It starts with d4, d5, knight to f3, knight f6, and bishop to f4 is the London system. Now e6, e3, c5, c3, knight to c6, bishop to d3, and bishop to d6 are all standard developing moves. Move your bishop back to g3, so if they take, you can open up the file for your rook. They'll castle, and you'll play knight to d2. Queen to e7 prepares to push the center pawn, but you'll block it with knight to e5. Knight to d7 challenges the knight, but you'll just take it, and after the bishop takes back, trade bishops, and play d captures c5. If if the queen takes, they'll lose because of the brilliant bishop captures h7 check. And after the king takes, you play queen to h5 check. The king has to go back to g8 and now knight to d4. The pawn is pinned to the undefended queen. Queen to c4 moves to safety. And now knight to g5 threatens checkmate. If queen to d3 to defend h7, block it with e4. Now the rook must move over to give the king room. And now you'll just take on f7. You'll play rook to d1 and eventually bring the rook into the attack or run your h pawn down the board. Follow me for more chess traps.